know, your team's start to this game and the difficulty of playing from behind? Uh, the turnovers killed us right away. You know, we, I think we had like seven turnovers in the first uh, maybe six, seven minutes of the game. They scored probably 10, 12 points off of those. And, uh, and that was uh, that had us kind of swimming upstream uh, for, uh, for the rest of the night. But I thought after that we settled down, did some good things. We just couldn't uh, couldn't string together enough uh, enough uh, good offensive possessions to ever uh, you know really make a, a push. Hey Steve, you had to be impressed with uh, what Marquise Chris did tonight. He had a pretty good game, and he continues to really. Look like a guy who's going to be a cornerstone maybe in your future. I, I thought Marquise was great again. He's uh, he's strung together a, a really good couple of months here for us and uh, playing with a lot of energy and confidence. And uh, yeah, he was great again tonight. How was the three point selection in this one? Some of them looked open. It was just a rotten night. Yeah, just a tough night. Four for 28. Um, I thought our guys did some, some good things, uh, especially. After the first quarter, we started to move the ball better. And second half, we had some great possessions, drive and kick, and uh, you know got some some open looks. Just one of those nights where um, shots didn't go down. Steve Andrews obviously only been here still two weeks. How close do you think he is from knowing the system and where he needs to be offensively? And defensively? Well, he knows uh, he knows our plays. You know, it, it, um, so that that's not an issue. Uh, I think. Um, I think it'll uh, it'll be a big deal when Steph comes back, just so he can feel what it's like playing next to Steph uh, and Draymond together. So I think that's the bigger thing is um, you know playing next to the guys. He'll be uh, he'll be uh, you know in the lineup with next year, uh, and I think he'll fit in nicely with those guys. So it's uh, it's but he's he's doing a good job of um, you know executing the offense and he knows what he's doing out there. Uh, but you know we're we're, we're uh, shorthanded right now, and as we get healthier, I think uh, I think you'll see him fitting in uh, better uh, because he'll be able to to kind of fit uh, fit into his role. Jordan Poole is finishing significantly better than he was maybe the first few months. Why do you think that is? I think just typical rookie year. Uh, you know, you, you learn a lot as you go, and uh, the game slows down a little bit, and you just start to feel more confident. And uh, I think that's what I see with Jordan. He's just, uh, you know, he's gained a lot of confidence since the beginning of the year, and he's worked hard, so he's uh, done a good job. Anything else? Thanks. Great, thank you. We'll have a few guys up here from me, Damian and Andrew. Good time.